storm show. Hey, it's a storm show. What's up guys? So this is my first week with Smile Love and I just really wanna take you guys through my journey. I can let you guys know why I decided to go with Smile Love and how my experience has been so far. I know everyone is gonna be a little bit different, but I can just let you know basically what I've went through. So let me start from the beginning. I decided to go with Smile Love because I needed a solution to my crooked teeth in the back. I, um, about 10 years ago, I I had a lot of teeth removed. I had baby teeth pulled that had just never fell out. And my dentist at the time told me that later on in life, if I didn't get like a, a bridge, I think that's what they call it, or an implant, that my teeth would shift and I would eventually need braces, right? But I ignored it, I didn't worry about it. I was 16 at the time. 10 years later, I'm 26 and now those very same teeth in the back were causing periodontal disease and my now, did well, the dentist then also went ahead to tell me that, look, you know, you're gonna need braces. You're gonna need to get these teeth straightened out. You cannot clean all of the teeth in the back and it's just causing you issues. So long story short, I did not have thousands of dollars to spend at an orthodontist office. I could not afford to have all of those trips back and forth, have those metal braces in my mouth that's cutting it inside of my lips and just really causing me a lot of issues. And I kind of wanted a solution where, you know, I could wear them when I needed to and then take them out if I needed to as well. So I decided to go with Smile Love. Now, when you go, when you start your journey on, you know, a clear aligner, right? You got a few different options because there's a lot of competitors out there. I decided to go with Smile Love because they had a 4.5 rating on average, right? The uh, Smile Direct did not have that. And then Invisalign, Invisalign was a whole nother issue. I didn't even go with them because they were really expensive. So it really came down to Smile Direct or Smile Love for me. And I chose Smile Love because of the price and the good reviews. And in addition to that, they have really good customer service. Anytime you have an issue, you go to the website, you send them a message and they, they chat right there with you and will answer any concerns. So I went ahead, um, I did not have $1,400. I didn't have that money, of course, so I decided to go with the payment plan. So right now I spent about $79. The process to get the loan was really easy. I was approved and done and had all my paperwork done probably in like 10, 15 minutes. And then my impression kit was on the way. So when my impression kit arrived, I would say it arrived within within four days of me ordering the actual box. It came, came in the mail. I went ahead and followed the instructions, made my impressions, but what they give you in that impression box is kind of like a practice impression, right? So it teaches you how to roll the dough, how to actually get a good bite on your teeth to make sure when you get your aligners that they are correct. I did that. It took me several tries before I actually got it right i went back and forth with i believe it was jessica in the customer service department i went back and forth with her many times before i got it right and she said okay you're clear to go ahead and make your impressions I got that done. I set my little timer, used the impression kit to actually make a mold of my upper and my lower teeth. It was really simple, really easy. I shipped it off. Um, uh, Smile Love let me know once they actually received my impressions. And then at that point, I just had to wait on my aligners. Now, my aligners took a little bit longer than usual. I was expecting them back. I was expecting them back in maybe like a month or so. It took like two months, but that was just because of summer production. They were really behind. And me personally, I would rather be patient and wait for my aligners to come and they be correct versus smile love rushing them and then I have to send them back and then it's just a whole process and a bunch of confusion. So I'm actually show you guys what all comes in the box now. I'm in week one, like I said, so I'm past the impression kit, I'm past that stage, but that stage was really easy. Now, when my box came, it comes just like this, you know, really nice and simple box. And then this is all what comes in there. So let me show you guys. So in a Ziploc bag, you're gonna have all of your aligners for your complete treatment, right? This is from step one to step whatever. I'm gonna be wearing them for about 10 months. So I have, I wanna say, 
I know it's over 11 steps. It's kind of escaping my mind at the moment. But anyway, on every single package of aligners, they have directions, tell you what to do and what not to do. Then you also get a carrying case. So this is when you know you leave the house, you go to work, you want to go out to eat, you want to go to a party, you're able to take your aligners out when you eat or if you have to drink anything that's dark. Keep in mind, these are supposed to stay in your mouth about 22 hours a day. I say at least do 21 to be on a safe side so that way you're getting through your treatment plan as quickly as possible. But to pop them out and pop them in is really easy. You just take them. You want to push down from the back. Actually, that might be the top. My bad. <laughs> and then you do the bottom. Boom, you wait for it to click and boom, it's in just like that. Now, you may have a little bit of a lisp at first, you know, I have one just because these are also fixing an overbite that I have. So it's literally changing my bite, you know, as we go through the, the treatment plan. But as you can see, you can't even really tell that they're there. You know, you only, you only know because, ah, whoo. You only know because, you know, my voice, my speech changed a little bit. But so far, this first week was was interesting. OK, so I want to break down everything you would need when you actually get your aligners in the mail. Number one, you will need chapstick or Vaseline or petroleum jelly, whatever you prefer to use. I go with petroleum jelly because these will at first make your lips really chapped because you're changing your bite, you know, your mouth may be open more than you realize, it's affecting saliva production, so you definitely wanna make sure that the inside of your lips here are protected. You wanna drink plenty of water just to keep a good uh, moisture balance in your mouth, and you're actually gonna need aspirin, right? Not for everybody, but at least for my case, cause my teeth were really, like, just really crooked in the back, and I've never had braces. If you've had traditional braces, then getting these aligners is gonna be a, a walk in the park for you. But if, if you've never had traditional braces, just never had nothing like that on your teeth, this is gonna be a shock. <laughs> uh, make sure when you put in your aligners and even when you change them out every two weeks, put them in at night. Put in the new ones at night, take you some aspirin just to help with any discomfort and you'll be on your way the very next day. I've been able to drink water normally. You can drink anything clear when I eat. I simply plan around the time I wanna eat. If I'm outside of the house, then I keep a toothbrush with me, some floss and toothpaste wherever I go. Because if you eat, you need to clean your teeth, floss, brush, rinse out before you put the aligners back in. Now. As far as cleaning the aligners, I actually went and got denture cleanser, right? So every morning, I give me some water, pop the little tablet in there, pop the aligners in there, let it soak for at least three minutes, and then those are good, clean, and ready to go. You can also run a toothbrush over them if you need to. You can run water over them. Just don't use super hot water and then don't use toothpaste on the actual aligners because it can just be really abrasive and can uh, and ruin them and which is what you do not want to do i think that's really it as far as the box is concerned let's show you what else you will get a little file that comes in the box as well so that if um the aligners are a little too big and they're irritating your gums go ahead and buff them down but i haven't had any trouble like that you also get your improvement record and movement record which is going to show you how your teeth will move throughout treatment I'm not really sure how to read it, and uh, I just kind of let it sit there, but it's cool to look at. Already shows you guys the carrying case. And then you get this here, which is a tool to pop in and pop out the aligners. You get little chewies that you can use to help set them when you first get them, but I don't even need them at this point. I know exactly how to put them in. And now if you're also ordering your your aligners within the last couple months, you're gonna get sanitizing spray. And with this spray, you know, if you're outside of the house and you need to take them out, you just spray the aligners, wait 30 seconds, and then you can pop them back in and they're ready to go for you. So, like I said, this is only week one, guys. I will be vlogging monthly my experience with Smile Love. 
If you want to get Smile Love, feel free to email me if you got questions, monroestorm59 at gmail.com. DM me on Instagram. All the information will be down below. But remember, if you're going to get them, use my code. It's my first name, Storm, S-T-O-R-M, and then the number is 550. That's going to give you $550 off your aligners. Guys, if you need them, don't pay any more than what you actually have to. So that's been my experience so far with Smile Love, my first week down. I will be vlogging next month to show you to basically talk about my experience in a full month of having them. Let me know what you guys think down below, or if you have any questions, I will be answering them. Like, comment, subscribe, and I will catch you guys next time. Uh, it's Storm Show. Hey, it's Storm Show.